it's Nona, and I'm here with my Holy Grail makeup products video. Uh, this is subject to change at any time, but as of right now, these are my favorite products to use uh, daily. Um, without getting bored, with, you know, I don't have any problems out of them. They work great for me and my skin tone, and I just think they are really gorgeous together. Um, it's a mix of some high-end, but mostly uh, drugstore, so it's a look that most people could achieve. Most people could get these products because I usually go for the lower end of makeup because I don't have a lot of money to spend on makeup, although I would like to. So anywho, I'm going to start out with exactly how I put them on my face and show you each one of them. Um, this is my Holy Grail lip balm. It's the Queen Helene 100% Cocoa Butter. I put this on at the very beginning of my makeup process for the day. Next is the Nivea Men's Post Shave Balm. This is my primer. It's awesome. It smells great. It works great. It's cheap as heck. Um, so next, I got the Revlon 24 Hour Color Stay in buff this is my all-time favorite foundation it's matte and it doesn't budge I mean it stays on I've even cried and it stayed on I sweat like a pig it stays on um, next I have the Maybelline instant age rewind and this is the uh, under eye primer I love this stuff I am starting to get purple circles under my eyes the older I get, and that stuff does wonders for them. Next is my Holy Grail uh, powder. This is the Cody Airspun in Translucent. I love this stuff. It reminds me of my grandma, but I still love it. It's still a great product. Uh, then I have the, <clears throat> excuse me. The Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer. This stuff is so awesome. And it smells like suntan lotion. So if you don't like a scent to your makeup products, you probably won't like this. But the texture is literally butter. It's just like the name says. And it works great for light skin tones, which I am. And it's cheap. I got it at Walmart. Um, for my highlight... I love the Balms Mary Luminizer. I just got this the other day. It's absolutely gorgeous. Just a gorgeous, gorgeous highlighter. I don't know if you can see that because the lighting is so terrible in here. But Next is my go-to blush and it's the Milani Powder Blush and it's shaped like a rose how gorgeous is that and this one is in coral cove i think this is a gorgeous color to wear during the summertime for my eyes i like this nyc uh city proof 24 hour eye primer i love this stuff it's just a big chunky pen you just draw it on your lid tap it with your finger to clean up the edges you know to blend it out and it works great keeps your shadows on all day and I don't have a problem with it creasing either then I have the elf high definition under eye setting powder this is a loose powder I like to put it under my eyes to bake and to keep it under there when I'm doing my shadows so if there's any fallout I can clean it up easily I love elf products Next is my favorite single shadow. It is Wet n Wild Brulee. I love to use this as an all over blending shadow. It's, it's just great and it's a buck. So what more can you ask for? My favorite eyeshadow palette is the Kat Von D Monarch palette. It has these gorgeous shades. And I think it does a really gorgeous summer look with this orange here. Gorgeous. This color here. It's absolutely breathtaking. Love it. 
Then I like to use a white uh, eyeliner under my, uh, what am I talking about, under my, in my waterline. And I have the LA Colors Jumbo Eye Pencil in Seashells. It works great. Uh, next, my favorite uh, black eyeliner is the CoverGirl Perfect Point Plus Retractable Eyeliner. It's just a really nice black eyeliner. For my brows, I'm really digging this uh, Wet n Wild Color Icon Brow Pencil. And it has a pencil on one end just a sharpenable pencil and a spoolie on the other and y'all this does my eyebrows so good so so good I'm trying to see if it has a color on it but I don't think it does okay it's um brunettes do it better brunettes do it better and we do <laughs> just playing for my mascara I'm addicted to the Super Sizer. This stuff is so good. It's by CoverGirl. And it has a really unique wand. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. But some of the sides of it are flat. And they just hold on to product. And you twist it while you're applying the mascara. I don't know if you can see that. And like I said, the lighting's horrible in here. But this stuff, I swear by it. Um, it's awesome. Then my favorite lip liner is the L'Oreal Color Riche in the color Toffee to Be. And it's this beautiful color here. It's a retractable. It's just a really pretty nude color. And my favorite lip product is this Cat's Wink lip gloss a friend of mine here on youtube sent me this in a friend mail and um this is from asia i think it's called manshui the manshui brand it doesn't have a color on it it has a number and it's the number 24 so this is just a really really pretty nude lip gloss and i love it it's so pretty that very good but anywho those are my favorite products at the moment they all work excellent for me and maybe you know you should give them a try uh, like I said they're mostly drugstore so they're cost effective and they work if you like these types of videos, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And if you have a channel, I will subscribe back. Love to all. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.